please follow the instructions presented to install the SmartRack software. The setup file will be on the pen drive, along with the SmartRack 10 data logger. First, connect data logger to the PC using USB cable and press data logging button. Open the SmartRack software. To connect the data logger, select a port and press the connection button. After connection, it shows USB connected. Channel configuration page help to program the data logger before start any task. In first tray, it shows port selection, connect, disconnect, and reset the offset. Information tab shows the data logger name with its serial number. Parameter tab allow to choose thermocouple type, temperature unit, and the scanning rate per channel. After changing the scanning rate, please press the enter button to save the entry. In trigger mode, we have three different type of trigger mode. First start and stop button, second time and date, third is temperature. For the complete thermal profiling curve, we suggest to choose start and stop button as the trigger mode. We have the option of switching languages between English and Russian. From the channel list tab, we can select all the channel same time or an individual channel as per the requirement. Channel list shows channel number, its temperature, and we can give any name to the channel based on requirement. We can also use this offset feature to correct out temperature readings. This internal temperature tab shows the data logger ambient temperature. This reset offset button clear all the preloaded offset on one click to the ever channel. This tab shows the device name with the device time and date. We can also see battery percentage from here. To disconnect the data logger after successfully configure the data logger, please press disconnect button. Now close the tab. Now open the software, choose port and press connect button. After connection, it show USB connected. After successful test completion, go to the data logging page. Here we can see the stored data in memory in data tab. Graphical tab, convert data to the graph for the analysis. Numerical mode will show the temperature data with date and time. Use retrieve data button to collect data from the data logger to the software. Now we can see all the data logger stored data here. Now double click on any data to view its graphical form. Here in the graphical form of the, the different channel temperature curves are presented via different color lines. From dragging mouse to the curves, we can see curves data by scrolling zoom in and out to the graph. Or you can select a range of graph. You can also select the channel curves to show or hide can enable the selected curve lines to show on the graph. Numerical tab shows the selected graph data into the numerical mode. It shows every channel data in terms of temperature with data and time. The Export Data button helps to save the data into PC in channel-wise or cycle-wise. We can store the data at any location into the PC. Click on the Report button to generate report via software, report like TTR, Traveling Temperature Recorder, TUS, Temperature Uniformity Survey. Now entry the required details for the report like company name department operator name, customer name item used. Test number data logging, Interval run description model and serial number are based on smart track data logger, trigger mode used, what is the track speed of the conveyor and what is set point of the oven O furnace in user note section, we can entry brief description or instruction of the test run. We can total five required set point which are used for survey. That set point helps in check curing time at different temperature. To give set point, we need to entry the temperature range and time duration we required. We can add thermal profiling installation image via path button and select the image, so that image will be add in the report section. We can also add graph image via path button and select the graph image, so that graph image will be add in the report section. Now click on report button to generate the report. Report will be generated. In report menu, here are some feature that can be used is refresh, print, print layout, page setup, and export. In the export section, we can export the report in the Excel, PDF, and Word format. All given details are mentioned in the report. We can see the images are also attached in the report. Here, the given set point are shown. Channel-wise set point data is shown. BCT shows the between curing time. The between curing time is the total time taken for the product to reach and maintain a temperature between two set points during the curing process. A CT is actual curing time. 
The actual curing time is the duration required for the product to cure at a specified temperature above the set point. We can see the max temperature recorded into each channel. Now export the data via PDF mode and save it to the desired location. To disconnect the data logger, press disconnect button. Now close the tab. To disconnect, first press and hold data logging button to off the data logger. Then disconnect from the data cable.